and also Vice President Yemi Yoshibanjo has inaugurated some rehabilitated health facilities at the University Teaching Hospital Ibadan, or your state. The Vice President said the project is a significant step towards improving the quality of healthcare services and achieving the sustainable development goals in Nigeria. We'll bring you more on this report. The University College Hospital in Ibadan is one of the country's premier health facilities providing specialized medical care to Nigerians and serving as a training ground for medical professionals. However, like many health facilities in Nigeria, the UCH before now was in dire need of rehabilitation. The facilities which eventually got the attention of the federal government in 2020 and is now being inaugurated after getting upgraded to meet the growing demand for healthcare services. By December 2020, we got a notification that the massive rehabilitation of the hospital has been approved. By January 2021, contractors mobilized to site, and by the special grace of God, all the works embarked upon were completed in March 2023. In her address, the senior special assistant to the president on SDGs wants management of the institution to utilize the facilities judiciously to serve the purpose it was made for. My charge to the hospital management and to the foundation as well will be to get a list of all that needs to be done and let's begin to continue to look for different avenues to get the hospital totally brought up to state. Um, like we all know, the government cannot do it alone, whether it's the federal, whether it's the state, or whether it's the agencies. So let's be creative about the way we want to go about bringing the hospital back to the state where it was when it was done so many years ago. To the vice president, the development will play a significant role in quality health care delivery. This official commission today comes with the responsibility for all of us to judiciously use and maintain these facilities for the benefit of all. To complement this intervention, the office of the SSA to the President on SDGs has also constructed a 100-bed mother and child hospital at Onuara Ibadan, here in Ibadan. And I'm aware, I'm aware that this facility is fully equipped with state-of-the-art medical facilities as well. I look forward also to the sustainable use of these facilities in the years to come. The implementation of this project will contribute to the achievement of the Sustainable Development Goals and will significantly improve access to quality health care services in Nigeria. Dennis Ofik for Ibram TV News.